everybody, Orphan here. Welcome back to Pokemon Legends Arceus. Uh, last time, we saw Pokia and Dialga, and we caught Pokia in one ball, which was really nice. And we still can't evolve Sligu because the sky is red. Ugh, come on! Now I wish I leveled up my Pokemon to level 50, at the very least, to get Sligu to evolve before this happened. But, uh, this is still... Anyways, we're continuing on now. We got the Origin Ore. And we're continuing on now. So there's a stone of creation being, beginning, the origin aura. Yes, one can certainly feel an imposing aura emanating from it. Could this be the feeling of the very origin itself? I mean to ask since you brought that up, but the origin of what exactly? Of everything by the sound of it. Exactly, my girl. <coughs> now then, back we go to Jubilee Village. All right, Mr. Professor, it's all in pieces now, but there's a luck for Red Chain. Splendid. Even in pieces, I think we'll, I'm still perfectly fit for purpose. We're jolly lucky you had the foresight to pick up all these broken bits back at the temple. Your turn, Orphan. Next comes Stone of Creation's beginning. The fragment of the Red Chain, collected by a great, pers a great personal risk by a diamond plan. Stone of Creation's being, which we only learned that thanks to the Pro Plan. Last time for Gav's team to play its part and turn these items to a proper vessel. Kari, my girl, you are one of the team's race crafts, okay? Do you, could you do the honors? This is my true bow, Fedora Fade, even if it may be safe indoors. This may take us some time. Perhaps for us to you the best way to touch Sai while we work. Come on, Mr. Professor, wish they hurried up in there. I respect all your prowling about the value of time as a cover for your own impatience. If sitting back and waiting actually solved things, I'd sit forever because that'd be using time well, unlike this. We've done it, Orphan. It's complete. I dub it the Origin Ball. If the message conveyed to our good clan leader can be to allow you to catch the Pokemon that has appeared at the Temple of Sinnoh. On the Master Ball in this game. A single and irreplicable Pokeball that can be used to catch the friendly Pokemon raising at the Temple of Sinnoh. The Pokeballs you use are full of wonders. I think the fate of all of us you can rest in something so tiny. I think I'm catching a Pokemon and one of these brings the two of you closer together. Wait, please, I hear something. Their voice speaking in my mind again. You mean Pokia? Here's a nice Pokemon that's willing to lend its own strength to us in this battle. That's what I like to hear. A pro plant on my Sinnoh, well, I guess I just call Pokey as one fierce Pokemon. Everything's ready now. Take the Origin Ball and hurry back to Temple of Sinnoh together with Pokey. Pair well to make for the Temple of Sinnoh once more. Okay. Well. Oh, hello. I'll talk to you in a moment. But since the game seems like it really wants us to use Pokia, and the game, and I won't be able to evolve uh, Sligu at this point right now, I'm going to replace Sligu with uh, Pokia for now. So, just, just our, uh, I did not want to do that. Just a little, just gonna do that. And here you are, uh, and here you are, lost one, ready to face your fate atop Mount Cornet. And the vicious battle might await you. I'll go where I must. Well said. Now hearken to my words, young ones. Time cannot be severed from space, nor space from time. The being you encounter at Temple of Sinnoh's Dialga, ruler of all time. If it's allowed to run wild, time itself will twist and bend here in Nasui, and eventually the very world may be broken. The idea of its counterpart, Pokia, the ruler of space, and therein lies hope. Now, so we brought to time and space, and the world can once again be as it should. 
Now take Pokia at your side and make their Temple of Sinnoh once more. I must say, it's quite the intriguing field. Perhaps I'll look around before I go. See what your call there has to offer. I mean, is this the time for shopping? Well, I haven't got time for shopping at the world ends, will I, young man? Fair point. <laughs> Alright, Orphe, once you feel ready, set out. Take her to Temple of Sinnoh once more. I got interrupted and I have to stop right here. It'll be a weird, awkward cut. <clears throat> Alright, we are back. This, uh, this is like hours later. I got completely interrupted doing this. But this is hours later, still Halloween, and we're going onwards with Polkia. Uh, actually, before we go, here is a quick look at the team I have right here. And my items here. I actually probably should sell that Stardust and not have it in my inventory. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna sell that Stardust. I'm also gonna put the damn Dusk Stone in the frickin' box as well. So yeah. Put that in there as well. Let me sell that. Anyways, let's go. Let us continue onward to make for a temple of Sinnoh once more. There to face Dialga. I uh, actually. Doo -doo -doo. Whoops. Yeah, Origin Ball is a key item. I was worried for a moment. Two, three, four, six, eight, nine, ten. That's ten plates, but there's more than ten types. Oh. I very send me to the base camp, but I thought it might be helpful if I set up here closer to the temple. I want to have Fernando see through a chance to see into the world of myth and legend. I will be creeping even closer to the action once the battle actually begins. Oh, but you won't have to worry about me. I'm fairly capable of taking care of myself. Besides, I know all too well strength that you and your brother one. I got no doubt you had this whole thing tied up in a neat boat before I could possibly be in any danger. Alright, what do you got? Uh, revive, max revive. I'm low on money. Honestly, I'm gonna just go with what I have. I'm just gonna have to go with what I have, to be honest. So long, I thought that I had to eliminate any outside album and I threatened the people of Jubilee Village. Whether they were banishing you or seeking your street open temple, I felt it was my only path. But you showed me that I was wrong, I think, in such a way. Are you ready for this challenge? Probably not, but let's go. Orphan, in all vast space, your place is found. What in the world does that mean? It 
the pearl plant thing. It reminds us that occasions we must rise to our awesome stage where we may prove ourselves. And it might shine our brightest. Basically, you're saying not to feel nervous. I don't think see the people how you pearl plant people think in some situations anyway. It's quite in every way you can, though I doubt you'll need it. More fate to protect Pursuey and her people. Protect time and space for her Pokemon. Alright, that hell good time. to like Avalon. That was really easy. rain again. I can finally go do a fall. <laughs> That's all I care about. <laughs> Saving the world. <laughs> Secondary. Secondary to a fall. <laughs> he caught it. He really did, didn't he? My eyes aren't lying, right? He actually went and caught it. Yes, oh, good show, what a catch. You contain that fearsome thing in the origin ball. Absolutely astounding as ever, Warfare. Finally. Middle as usual, Warfare. Yes. <laughs> so even the commander said it's here now and then. Never thought I'd see the day. Yes, well, I to avoid next. No. Ow, 
Oh, 12 pips coming in. I'm not sure I deserve a zoom up, though. Yeah, we couldn't afford to animate. I mean, <laughs> at least it seems there's no dream. Listen up, all of you. We face a calamity unlike any we have known, but we are able to overcome by working together. Calls for a celebration, festival for us all. Gather your clans. This will be the greatest celebration the city has ever seen. Celebrate with the Diamond Clan? Two clans together, huh? Well, it turns out we are both following a true nice nice of our own. Guess the time to when we fight the, over the who's fight over who's was wrong or right or into history now. Sure, our ancestors would be shocked to see us agree. This may well be the best path toward protecting the space we all share. I'll celebrate for today dawns a new day for all those who live in that sweet region. Um, wow, okay. Uh, now obviously, the day at the end, there is a post game. Pokemon games always got post games. So we'll get to that. We'll get to the post game. Um, but this is definitely a very, very different direction for Pokemon. A very different. Um, like, I was not used to how different. It would be, it took a, it's a, it was, there was a lot of stuff I was like, oh god, this is, okay, music. It was so different in a way that I was not used to. I'm used to having a little bit of different with Pokemon, because I love Coliseum, Exceed of Darkness, and other different games, despite still being RPGs. Um, so, I wasn't, but I wasn't expecting, like, a super major difference. And what I got was a way bigger difference in gameplay than I expected from Pokemon. I expected the changes to be not much, you know. I expected, oh, we're going to be able to move around a little more. Kind of an expansion on Sword and Field thing, but eh, whatever. I didn't expect to the insane changes of throwing the Pokeball like we had to. Like, like actually moving around throwing the Pokeball, dodging Pokemon. Like, even though those definitely showed the trailers, I wasn't really expecting it in the way that it that it came about and whatnot. And definitely, po Pokemon fights were a lot different than I expected either because we don't have whole items, we don't have abilities. So just like Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee, Eevee, no, uh, no abilities. So we don't have that. There's not that, and. You know, fights, you can just move the camera around all you want, and whatnot. You know, you can move the camera however you want, or whatever. And it's interesting, they really built up this final boss fight. Let me just say this. This was maybe the easiest final boss I've had in Pokemon. E easiest? Ah, it's kind of on the same level as Diantha, with how easy this was. It was incredibly easy. I just... Dialga's attacks were not hard to dodge at all. Like, I hit one, what, once in that fight? Once? Maybe twice? I got hit in that fight? And I didn't even need to send out any of my Pokémon at all during that fight. It was just throwing the bombs. I was very surprised by that! I was like, I saw the new form, I was like, okay, we're gonna have to do a battle. You know, I wasn't expecting me to have to throw bombs at it. You know, I wasn't ready for that. Uh, it was interesting. You know, I wasn't ready for that. Thank you for adventuring with us.
Hey, here's everyone. Oh, I didn't, I wanted to look at that a little more. I wanted to look at the picture a little more. Your art. Oh. Seek out all Pope. Yeah, I'm working. I'll work on that, definitely. Prepare well and make for a temple. It's in a one wall. Okay. Let's just see real quickly what's going on. Good morning. Looks like space time with advanced so sky's called back normal again. Supposed to be bear back to the original mission complete the Pokedex. Eh, I mean the Survey Corps office to discuss our next steps. See you there soon. Right. Well, obviously I'll be for now. This was the end. I didn't expect such an easy final boss, but we will tackle the post game. We'll tackle the post game. And I will at the very least do all the side quests. Um I don't know how easy it'll be to do all the, to complete the Pokedex, but I'll definitely at least do side quests. We'll see when that goes on. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next part uh, where we start the post game. I enjoyed this game a lot. I'm ready to see what the post game has in store. It'll be a lot of catching Pokemon. Yeah, see you guys then. Hope you have a good day.